the subtitle to Take Back America, people keep asking me, from who say the Republicans and Democrats? To be clear, Red State Uprising is not a book about the Bolsheviks revolution. Correct. Correct. Yes. It uh, has, has a, nothing to do with the Bolsheviks other than those who are in charge in Washington destroying the country. To take back America and return it to her free market rules. To the people, yeah. I mean, the subtitle, To Take Back America, people keep asking me, from who say the Republicans and Democrats? You name names in the book. Uh, you write that John Boehner and Mitch McConnell are Republicans first, conservative second. Right. And you contrast them to... Uh, Congressman Jeb Hensling and Senator Jim DeMint, who you say are conservatives first and foremost. Right. I, I think that's an important distinction. It, it, it's because when you were a Republican first, you were focused on getting back into power. Uh, same as being a Democrat first. Parties are about the acquisition of power to pursue a policy. If you're a conservative first, you're about principles, and then you figure out a path to power to get those principles implemented. It, it's, it's a different worldview. What do you see happening in November? I think the Republicans are going to take back the House. I don't think they're going to take back the Senate. I, I never have thought they would with or without Delaware. I think it's too high a, a burden for them, which I don't think is a bad thing. If they take back the House and the Senate, Barack Obama is going to have a very ascertainable target to go after. If they only control the House and the Democrats block everything in the Senate, Obama can't really say the Republicans are destroying the country because they haven't been able to get their agenda passed. Well, let's say hypothetically the Republicans do pay, take back the House. They, too, they do take back the Senate. Do you have confidence that this a new GOP leadership will actually start to turn things around and uh, actually go back to the, the roots of the Constitution? The new boss will be the same as the old boss. Uh, particularly in the Senate, people forget that after Denny Hastert and Tom DeLay were gone, the entire House leadership changed other than Eric Cantor. And the Senate side, though, the exact same people who were there before 2006 are there now. So, I mean, when's the last You don't think the, the GOP time? has learned their lesson? Uh, not the Senate GOP. I think the House GOP largely has. The Senate GOP, no.